So who doesn't want to be successful? People go through a lifetime aspiring to achieve what they define as success. But how do we attain success? The simple yet profound answer can be found at the end of the Parsha of Pukudei, which marks the ending of the book of Shemot Exodus, where miraculously on God's command, Moshe managed to lift the tabernacle, which had just been constructed. Interestingly, the Midrash explains that just moments prior to that event, Moshe had actually complained to God and he said, Hashem, how will I ever be able to lift such a heavy structure single-handedly? And Hashem famously responded to Moshe, Don't worry, he said. You do your bit and I'll do mine. Likewise, it is this exact concept which we find at the beginning of the book of Exodus when Moshe was placed in a basket floating in the Nile River. Later on, Batya, the daughter of Pharaoh, walks past the Nile. She hears a child crying and she comes to Moshe's assistance, ultimately saving him. As we know, at such a great distance, she couldn't have physically reached the baby. She could have easily said, well, it's too far. I'll never be able to reach this basket. But nevertheless, she stretched out her arm and miraculously retrieved Moshe out of the water. Friends, this is the overall theme of the book of Shemot. This book reminds us just how important it is to actually put in that effort. True, we all want success, but we worry so much about the feasibility, the details, and just how complicated it'll be to achieve that all too often we give up before getting started. As obvious as it sounds, the book of Shemot reminds us just how vital it is to take that very first step. So just do it and let God take care of the rest. Shabbat Shalom.